Now, members of the University Teachers Association of Ghana and Senior Staff Association remain on strike despite an order from the National Labor Commission for them to call off the strike. Kashanti Regional Correspondent Ibrahim Abubakar joins us from the KNUSD campus with some updates. Uh, Ibrahim, Ibrahim, I know you've been monitoring this particular situation uh, at the KNUSD campus. Today at the Kwame Nkrumah University of Science and Technology, members of the two labor unions have defied that directive. Some students say the industrial action is impacting negatively on their academic activities. Honestly, it's affecting us in a way that we are supposed to start exams on Monday and looking at the way things are going, we are not able to start. Lectures are also supposed to be on campus, but due to the reasons, the, the issues they have with uh, the government, they are not to come to agreement to resolve the issue. So we are hoping they return to school and start academic activities for us to complete our exams so that you see the way forward. It has affected us very much because we are approaching exams and if we are preparing enough, we've prepared enough for the exams. but. With the strike issues, I don't think we'll be able to write the exams coming this week. And I think this one is going to affect us. I'm pleading with the government to resolve the issue with the UTAC so that we can write our exams before um, the coming week. As a former student, I mean, we've been studying throughout um, the whole semester and then, you know, just two or three weeks to go home and then there's a strike action. You know, emotionally, most people are affected. Myself, I don't know, I had prepared enough, ready for the exams. But right now, the morale is not there to learn again. Yesterday, I came to study, but then the whole day, I, I didn't read it, even a single slide. We don't know what is going on. Everyone wants to hear something. Government do something, you talk do something, but then... So, we all ahead from the news that if it continues for like the next two weeks, meaning, um, meaning um, the schools will be closed. And then, you know, already COVID has done a lot of harm to students. UTAG and Senior Staff Association members say they will only call off the strike when their demands are met by government. We will be following development in the various universities and update you in our subsequent bulletins. Ibrahim Abubakar, TV3, Kumasi.